Om Aham Bhatra Guru Padma City Hum Om Aham Bhatra Guru Padma City Hum Om Aham Bhatra Guru Padma City Hum Guru Rinpoche, also known as Padmasambhava Lotus Born, is a central figure in the history of Tibetan Buddhism. He is often considered the second Buddha for his pivotal role in establishing Buddhism in Tibet during the 8th century. Here is an overview of his legendary history, early life and birth according to tradition. Guru Rinpoche was born miraculously in the 8th century on a lotus flower in the middle of Lake Danakosha, located in what is now modern-day Pakistan or Afghanistan. His birth is symbolic, emphasizing his spiritual purity and transcendent nature. His name, Padmasambhava, meaning born from a lotus, reflects this miraculous origin. Role in Tibet in the 8th century. King Trisom Dietzen of Tibet invited Guru Rinpoche to Tibet to help overcome obstacles in building the first Buddhist monastery at Sami. Tibet was then a land influenced by indigenous shamanistic beliefs and rituals known as Ben. The construction of the Sami monastery was facing supernatural hindrances. And the king sought a master capable of dealing with the spiritual forces obstructing Buddhism spread in the country. Guru Rinpoche is believed to have subdued the local spirits and demons by engaging with them in spiritual practice, turning them into protectors of Buddhism. His arrival was critical to the formal introduction of Vajrayana Buddhism into Tibet, a tradition that blends tantric practices, ritual, and devotion to deities with deeper philosophical insights, teachings and influence Guru Rinpoche introduced and taught Vajrayana Tantric Buddhism, with its emphasis on mystical practices aimed at achieving enlightenment through the acceleration of the mind. He transmitted teachings that were secret and powerful, including the practice of Jogchen, a highly advanced form of meditation and realization. One of his key contributions was the Terama tradition. It is said that he hid spiritual treasures, known as Terama, which would be discovered by future Turton's treasure revealers when the time was right. These teachings have been fundamental to Tibetan Buddhism's ongoing development. Consorts and disciples Guru Rinpoche had several important female spiritual consorts. The most notable being Yesh Sagyal, princess who became his primary disciple. She is revered in Tibetan Buddhism as a fully enlightened being and is considered an equal to Guru Rinpoche. Together with his disciples, Guru Rinpoche established the foundations of Tibetan Buddhism, ensuring its growth and survival over centuries. Legacy and worship Guru Rinpoche's influence on Tibetan culture is profound. He is not just revered as a historical figure but as an enlightened being who transcends time. His birthday is celebrated in many Tibetan Buddhist communities. Statues and images of Guru Rinpoche are common in Tibetan temples, often depicted sitting on a lotus with a peaceful yet powerful demeanor, holding a vira and a skull cup. He is also credited with shaping the future of Tibet through his prophecies and teaching a path that combined wisdom with compassion. His legacy continues to be revered in Bhutan, Nepal, and among Tibetan Buddhists worldwide. Guru Rinpoche's story is a blend of myth, history, and spirituality, representing the transformative power of Buddhism in the Himalayas.